going to show you how to turn two Create Room Cubby units into the ultimate craft table. A custom craft table with storage on both sides can cost you thousands of dollars, but you can create something even better for a fraction of the price and we're not even going to use any power tools. All you need are two cubbies from Create Room and one IKEA tabletop. My son and I are assembling the cubby units first, and these are really easy to put together. The instructions are super clear, and it's just like putting together a basic bookshelf. I picked up this tabletop from Ikea and I really wanted it to be removable in case I rearrange my craft room, so instead of screwing it in, I'm just using these museum gel dots. These museum gel dots are very strong and sturdy, so the tabletop is not going anywhere. We moved this table around multiple times and it didn't budge, but if I needed to remove the top, I can just heat this up with a little hair dryer and the top will come off and there won't be holes in the top of the cubbies. So that way, if I ever want to use them without the tabletop, it won't be a problem. When you order a Create Room cubby, you have the option to choose between the InView totes or the Divi drawers. I have the InView totes in my dream box, so I thought I'd try out the Divi drawers this time. Divi drawers actually come flat and they have to be assembled first, so I'm putting them together before I start filling up the cubbies. Since I'm using the opaque side of the Divi drawers instead of the clear, it's a good idea for me to go ahead and make some labels for these. I like this transparent tape because it's easy to remove if I need to change the contents of the drawer. I have had this same label maker since I was in high school and it still works great. And as you can see, I lost multiple nails during assembly. I'm going to be using this craft table to hold all of my dollhouse building supplies. I've been renovating a dollhouse for the last couple of years and I've accumulated quite a few materials and supplies. I'm also using a couple of Create Room tool cubbies to hold all of my tools and paintbrushes and small wood scraps. I even had a few leftover drawers so I was able to put my Cricut infusible ink in there because my dream box is full and it didn't fit. Let me take you on a tour of how I organized each drawer.
If you've been looking at different craft tables and they were all out of your budget, I hope you give this a try instead. These two create room cubbies are perfect for storing everything in your craft stash without taking up a ton of space. You can save $50 on the Create Room Cubby with code Leela Burris Cubby at createroom.com. And you can find the full tutorial below on the blog.